Hey everyone, Mark here from Musclehead Homestead. Welcome back. In this video, we're gonna be doing a bit of land clearing today. In fact, for the better part of 2022, that's what we're gonna be doing. For those of you that are new to the channel, my wife and I bought five acres in Northern Oregon with the intention of becoming full-time homesteaders. We don't know anything about homesteading, but we are learning fast. Oftentimes, we'll be the perfect example of what not to do, but that is a part of our learning process. So we're gonna do the best we can to showcase that through this YouTube channel. So be sure to like and subscribe. And with all that being said, let me show you what we got going today. Looking at the property from this elevated view, you can see that we are only utilizing maybe 70% of what we currently own with the remaining 30% being taken up by thick brush, old dilapidated trees, saplings, and branches. So the goal is to break the property up into sections and attack each section at a time until the entire property is cleared of everything unwanted or dead. At that time, we'll have a better idea of what we're working with and designate the best location to put things like our garden, firewood shed, and chicken coop among a long host of other projects on our list. Which of course we'd love to get started building, but with the cost of materials like gas, lumber, and with interest rates continuing to rise because of this ass clown, we're forced to sit back, reassess our goals, and decide where to place our efforts and resources going forward. To put this plan into action, I'll be using my CK4010 Coyote tractor, brush hog, wood chipper, and of course a variety of other different cutting tools. The first thing I did is scout the section I'll be clearing to mitigate anything dangerous I might not be anticipating and to also get familiar with the landscape. So today we are going to be getting rid of all of this mess. You can see there is from this about this point on there is just a ton of debris, a ton of overgrowth. We have a lot of uh, fern bushes, fern plants, devil's walking club, uh, a lot of mossy birch trees, got some holly trees. And uh, I'm gonna find out what some of these are. I don't normally know what like this tree is. I know it's, these aren't very healthy. So, like I can break those relatively easy. We, we understand that it's going to take away a level of our privacy that we we do enjoy where we live but i think we'd we'd rather give up a little bit of privacy uh for for one more useful room that we can utilize we want to replace all this overgrowth and debris with plants and trees that we do want on our property and that we can maintain and keep manicured throughout the year and then uh, maybe it can produce fruit or something useful that can benefit the other plants around it so anyway with that all being said let's get started
make sure something don't come back and hit me in the face.
All right, so this is what we got done so far. As you can see, the tractor makes quick work of most anything I throw at it. I gotta tell you, I absolutely love my Coyote tractor and would no doubt buy another if I had to in a heartbeat. I love knowing I can work as hard as I want, all while having the confidence in its capabilities and build quality. It was by far one of the best investments we've made up to this point. Now in terms of the progress, I was able to knock down a lot of the brush and debris, so now we'll be focused on gathering it all up into a pile and either chipping it into mulch or burning it into ash for a compost bin. We still have a lot of clearing to do as we work toward each section further down the property line. The further we go, the more I'll be faced with steeper slopes and more difficult challenges to navigate as we advance closer to the back of the property. So if you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the subscribe button, check out some of our other videos, and thanks for watching. We're going to be going over a little bit of this video. We're going to be doing a little bit of yard debris cleanup. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to be doing a little bit of land clearing. In fact, the majority of 2022, we're going to be doing a lot of land clearing. Uh, that is our learning process and one that we are intending on sharing through this YouTube channel. So be sure to like, subscribe, all that being said. Let's get into it. Let's let the destruction begin. And that's by blunt force trauma. So without further ado, let's start the talking and get my ass to work. <laughs> 